Thank you. Thank you, Mr. President. Thank, Thank you, very you very much. much. Your Excellency, again, you can count on my support and that of my government in ensuring that we take a common position when we go to um, Sham al-Sheikh later uh, next month so that we can, in a robust manner, in an honest conversation, be able to have a discussion on the effects of climate change, especially those of drought, those of famine, the loss of uh, um, wildlife, the loss of livestock, and the threat to human life that is being caused by the ravages of climate change, and have a candid discussion on the matter of loss and damage, and how we can work with multilateral organizations to provide financing for resilience, climate change financing, for mitigation, for adaptation, and for the after effects. We have agreed that uh, at the ministerial level, we will have an engagement in Spain, and my Minister for Foreign Affairs will uh, come with our business uh, fraternity so that we can have a business um, engagement between the private sector in Kenya, the private sector in Spain, and be able to work on a common ground of how um, we can leverage on this good relationship to build the economies of our countries for the mutual benefit of our two countries. We recognize the investments by public and private corporations and multilateral institutions generate positive benefits to the economy and enable technology transfer diversity of our country. We invite Spanish investors to tap into these positive attributes that Kenya offer. And I want to say, Your Excellency, as I told you earlier, we have real concrete opportunities in our blue economy. Um, harvest of the huge resource we have in our, uh, of, of our, our coast, the processing, the value addition, and the whole components that come with the, uh, the, the blue economy. Your Excellency, we have discussed in broad aspects the ongoing climate crisis, which continues to subject humanity to unprecedented challenges. It is catastrophic effects as evident by the current drought in the Horn of Africa. And I have explained to you that we are living a nightmare with close to two and a half million heads of livestock uh, that have been wiped out by drought, and about 3.4 million citizens facing um, a serious situation. Your Excellency, I look forward to joining the alliance Spain and Senegal have started on pushing back desertification. And I also uh, commit that Kenya is going to be a partner, is going to work with you, and all the other um, um, community of the willing so that we can together forge a united front as we tackle matters climate change and especially as we go to Sham al-Sheikh in Egypt to deal hopefully with 
and come up with a broader understanding on climate change, climate resilience, and how we can finance all the interventions and also assist the countries that have suffered the brunt of climate change, and especially have a candid conversation around um, loss and damage that has occurred around the world. Your visit this afternoon, Your Excellency, to the Kenya Industrial Research Institute will provide an opportunity for you to assess progress of the Business Incubator for Africa Women project, which is jointly funded by the Spanish government and NEPAD. Kenya appreciates the support that your government has given to this project that brings to micro and small enterprises, especially those led by women, and aimed at addressing numerous challenges facing women entrepreneurs in our continent. <clears throat> we seek to continue the technical and other assistance to boost financial mechanisms in Kenya, micro, small, and medium enterprises, including support from multilateral, the EU, and the European investment banks by financing certain aspects of the developments of our MSMEs. Mm -hmm.